our first talk for today is uh, Kara and Deanna. Give it up. And we think we need another mic for them. We got another mic for them, Jeff? We got to do it. We do have another mic. <laughs> Not that I'm sure we really need mics because we're both very loud. Yeah, I'm willing to do it. So <laughs> she like tried to crush every bone in my hand. Uh, yeah, that's a separate ignite talk. <laughs> yeah. All right, and then hit the space bar. Uh, right. You guys are gonna be ready. Soon as we just right. We're good. We're good. All right, so my name's Deanna Stanley. This is my friend and frequent collaborator, Kara Bergen. We're here to talk to you about all the stars that are within your team. Don't worry, zero telescopes were harmed in the making of this talk. Okay, is this your team? Are you divided? Maybe by functionality? Maybe by clicks? Do you have that big, sexy dev team? That, uh, Ops team off to the side, you're throwing stuff too, in that little bitty sec team that maybe you ignore every once in a while. Or are your teams more like this, where you don't really see any delineations between the stars? You're all working together in one gigantic cluster, lighting up the night sky so that everyone can see you burn in glory. So, how do you get to be that star cluster? And this is what we're here to talk about. We're here to talk about not the latest tool, but people. And we're gonna talk about how you can turn into a star cluster by going through the three H's. And the first H is honest. And what do we mean by honest? It means knowing what we're good at, and yes, knowing what we're bad at. So watch out guys, this is time to do a little bit of soul searching, because I want you to really think, we're not all per, okay, I'm perfect. Everyone else? <laughs> And we did soul searching within ourselves. We're using ourselves as an example. And how do you say type A without saying type A? My strengths, which are also on the front. I am detail oriented and driven, and I like to get into the weeds. And how do you say party planner without <laughs> saying party planner? You take a look at my strengths. I am creative, I am wildly enthusiastic, and I am people focused. I will cheer you on the way to hell and back. Just don't expect me to follow. That's right. So, but you also have to look at your weaknesses and my weaknesses, well, type A's are also anal retentive. I mean, let's be honest. I like to go down uh, rabbit holes. I can, you know, go off into the weeds and stay there for a while. Um, Deanna wanted me to put that I don't know anything about Star Trek on there too. <laughs> <laughs> and me, I'm a flake. I openly admit it. I can't plan. In fact, you show me a schedule and I'm going to run away and douse it with holy world water. <laughs> I get distracted. I get, I'm bored with the slide. Forget it. Can we just move on? So the next stage is holistic. So now we've been honest. We know our strengths. We know our weaknesses. Now's the time that you figure out how to put them together into a cohesive team and figure out how to use your strengths and weaknesses together to move yourselves along. Exactly. So Kara, keeps me on track. Without her, I would never get anything done. I could come up with a million ideas, but that's as far as it's ever going to go. Boy, am I good at writing ideas down and never following through. And she keeps track of deadlines. Apparently, those are important. That's right. And, and for me, Deanna keeps me from being wordy. You already saw me go right through a slide. I can talk for ages on end unless <laughs> <laughs> left to my own devices. And there we go. So All right. that final H. So now we move on to humor because you know what? You're going to be working with people for eight hours a day, five days a week at least. You're either going to scream or you're going to laugh. And I don't know about you, but I'd rather laugh. So what's the bane of our existence? Meetings. So, but the great thing about meetings is that you're all together, all at once. Use some of that time to your advantage. We like to have a little chit chat at the beginning of meetings and, you know, talk about anything. Travel, hobbies, celebrity gossip kind of on occasion. Yeah. Please feel free to make jokes because, again, laughter bonds in ways that very few other things do. But make sure when you're making those jokes that you look around and ensure that everyone's laughing with you. You don't want to be excluding somebody with your humor. And it's okay to laugh at yourself. As you can tell, that's how, what we base this whole talk around. Not only to give you some information, but also to laugh at ourselves. We are very honest about our faults and our weaknesses. A lot of people don't want to be, oh my god. Uh-oh. <laughs> 
Whoops, a doodle. Okay, so uh, let's see. Um, let's I, completely riff. Oh, okay. And the other thing I want to say in terms of laughing at yourself, we laugh at ourselves so much, we're wearing shirts with our strengths and weaknesses on them. Come find us. You'll be able to find us out, out wandering around. So again, from easiest to hardest, know what you're good at. Everyone knows how amazing they are. Know what you're bad at. You may not want to admit it, but none of us except me are perfect. And then you, here's the scary and hardest part. Share it with everyone. Once you share it, then you can start figuring out how you can work together as a team. Um, for Deanna and I, we riffed back and forth in order to make these slides. I'm the wordy one, so I didn't make the slides. But you figure out how to get things done. So yeah. Just remember, you can just start those meetings with a little bit of chit chat and make the people around you smile because you know what? There's nothing worse than being grumpy all day. And learn to laugh at your mistakes because we're always going to do it. So we wanted to have this talk to not focus on the latest tools, container, whatever, but to talk about people. People are the things that are going to make your DevOps transformation run. Value your people and you'll have a great transformation. Thank you. Great job.